I filming? Hello, hello, hi everybody, how you doing? Why am I so low? Like, shoot, how do you do this? Maybe, move myself in here. There we go, hi. So I have a big charm aroma ship a mint today. Um, let me put that in here, but I wanna show you something first. Look what I got, everybody. I got Ennis. Yay, the energy of the sea. One of my favorite body lotions. Um, so I really, I have three brands, four brands that I love. Okay, so this is the cheapest one. This is BASD. This is creme brulee. I love the smell of this. This one is like empty now. Um, but you can get this on Amazon and there's usually like a $3 coupon. So I get it for like $13 plus tax. And this is a Canadian company. I love the creme brulee. That's my favorite one. And I use this all the time. Um, oh my God. I, like I just bought a bottle. I think, excuse me, I'm going to burp. Excuse me. It got delivered like last week. I think it was. And I swear like this is my sixth, seventh bottle of this lotion that I've bought in, in the last three or four years. I love it. It's a great price. I mean, you can't go wrong. I think it cost me like $16 taxes and everything. And um, this one is a 240 mil. So if you're looking for a good body lotion, I have really, really freaking, really, really freaking dry skin. And I love this one, okay? My other favorite one, the Sol de Janeiro, uh, the Coco one, I love that. I like it because it stays on your skin all day. Like you can smell it. I like a, a lotion that not only moisturizes, but stays on your skin all day. You know, you can smell the smell of it. The one thing I don't like about Sol de Janeiro is that it leaves my hands sticky. I mean, I'm, just wash your hands and then your hands are not sticky. It's weird because my body's not sticky, but my hands are sticky. Just wash your hands and you're good. Anyway, the other one that I like, I just did an advent calendar, The Rituals, some of their body lotions I absolutely love. I love a lotion that the, cement, the scent of it stays on your skin all day and that it works, right? It's got to moisturize, right? This is one, the fourth favorite. Um, not in no particular order. It didn't go from one to number four, but this, oh my God, we got this in brown paper packages. Um... Oh my, four, three years ago, something like that. And it is really hard to find here. And why do I feel like I'm just, come down a bit, girl, girl, come down a bit. It's really, really hard to find in Canada. Uh, there are different stores, but nothing was ever close to, like there is a store, I think downtown in Toronto, but it's always sold out. Like you can find it in little shops, like little Irish store shops. It's Ennis. The Energy of the Sea Revitalizing Body Lotion. This is a 500 mil, and you're gonna go, you paid what for it? But here's the thing, 500 mil of Ennis for 51.99. I legit have paid 27 plus tax for 75 mils of Sol de Janeiro. So for 75 mils for 30 bucks, Sol de Janeiro, or 500 mils of Ennis for 50 bucks. So I think this is the much, much, way much better deal. This body lotion, I absolutely love it. And I found it in this store in Barrie. So if you guys live in Barrie, Ontario, it is called Our House Barrie. I ordered it online and we went to Barrie last weekend for Thanksgiving dinner. Uh, we met Ian's family at the Mandarin there. So I ordered it online and they kept it for me in the store. And then when I went last Saturday, went to the store and picked it up. But they have this beautiful shop online full of a lot of awesome things, you know, like a little mama pop shop. They've been there for a long time. Um, the whole, everything Ennis is in this store. There's a, a whipped, like a butter body lotion, a whipped body lotion that I really want to try. Um, but I got this one and it's got all kinds of, and this is kind of like ritual. You know what I mean? I freaking love the smell of this. I wore this out on my honeymoon and I was looking for it because I really, no, I wore it on my wedding day because this here, the scent stays on you all day, all day long. 
and I wore it on my wedding day and I was looking for it. I really wanted it for my honeymoon and I got it and we're going on our honeymoon Thursday. Yay! So I'm so happy I got it for my honeymoon. Um, and then I bought some Tatcha. Um, I'm kissing makeup, which I'm very happy that I got some Tatcha because I literally ran out of my moisturizer. Just move this table back. I do have to send the girl a picture though because one of them has gone bad. So I gotta send uh, send her a picture. So I just grabbed it. four or five Tatcha. It was a great deal. Anyways, that's what I wanted to show you. Um, I don't think there is anything else. Everything else is over on my bed, and that's another video that I'll be doing on. It's going to be a, a subscriber video. That's coming up. Anyways, we're going to open this box. So, what did I order from Charmed Aroma? Well, I don't know what's in here, and the reason why I don't know what's in here is because it was all surprise candles. So, Charmed Aroma had a, a sale, was it last week? Last week or the week before, something like that. I love my candles, my owl. Oh, you can't even see it. Why can't you see my owl, girl? My owl. Anyway, she's all burned out. She's all used up. <laughs> that owl is all used up. I burned her, girl. She she burned. Flavor's gone, you know. Flavor flayed. We burned her up. I don't know what is going on here. Why? I don't know. I was... <sighs> Jesus. I was messing... Not messing with the background, but I... I just did another video and it was just a big long mess. <laughs> this video is gonna come after that one so you'll know the rituals one. Oh my God, girl, it was a 48 minute video, 48 minute. So everything is a mess right now. I have to get things back in here. So Charmed Aroma had the sale and you can get three surprise candles for $45. And I'm like, all right. Let's do it. So I got six. So I, I ordered two sets, right? Three is one set and three more candles is another set. So I ordered two sets and here's 20% off your next purchase, but it can't be anything on sale, which sucks. Sucks ass. Right. So I don't know what they are and I hope they're not all the same because if they're all the same, that's really going to piss me off. I don't want six of the same surprise candles. I don't want two of the same surprise candles. Like I ordered six, so give me six different candles. And I'm really hoping they're not the crappy ones. Because there are some that don't have a great throw on it. So this one is, oh, we got Nature Walk. This is a ring candle. It's called Nature Walk. And I have, I can smell apple. Size five, okay, cool. Not tell me what the scent is, but I can smell apple. So it's gotta be some kind of like a pumpkin apple or something like that. Cause that's what I smell. I smell cinnamon. I'm thinking some kind of a cinnamon pumpkin apple. Yeah, not tell me what, it doesn't tell you what the flavor Flav is, right? My jeez, I fixed my glasses by the way. If you watch my other video, let me know in the comments down below on which video did I make that I broke on my glasses and threw them. Let me know which video did I post where I broke these glasses and threw them on the floor. Yeah, so it's not telling me what the flavor flav is in this, what the scent is, but it's definitely, I'm thinking pumpkin, Cinnamon, apple, something like that. All right, not bad. I like that. The throw on that is going to be good. I'm not upset with that one. The throw is going to be good, right? So I like. I'm going to be taking one of these to Dominican with me as well. Um, I do have my ritual candles, but I love for my hotel rooms. And always, always take a candle with you if you're going to a hotel or a resort. Just so you can have a nice smell there, you know. Oh, this is sugar and spice. Oh, I like this one. Sugar and spice. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, this one is like, um, it's almost like the pecan waffles or something. It's, oh, it's that, uh, oh my God. It's like a salted 
popcorn, uh, buttered popcorn. It's, it's that one that you know the scent is going to go through the house. That one. I like that. I like you. What are you? Are you a ring candle? Yeah. So this one is a ring candle. Okay. I'm still upset with Charmed Aroma because they don't have the watermelon candles anymore. I keep these. If I do a sale or something, they're perfect, right, to send away. All right. Next one is Apple Cinnamon Vanilla, and it's a ring. Okay. I hope they're not all Apple Cinnamon. This is definitely, my nephews are going to like this one. Mmm. Apple Cinnamon Vanilla. So those are three, and there's three more. So what do I think? I think out of the three, the apple cinnamon vanilla and the nature walk and the sugar and spice so far, this one is my favorite. I love this kind of one. It's like that vanilla, but I don't know. Uh, what do you... It's like creme brulee or something. Do you know what I'm talking about? Butterscotch or something like that, right? So this one's my fave so far, the sugar and spice. And these ones are kind of similar. Not exactly, but kind of. Because this one here, you definitely smell the, the cinnamon and the... Uh, no, this one. You can smell the cinnamon that. Maybe it's that pumpkin. This one, you can definitely smell the apple and the cinnamon. And... This one here is a stronger scent than this one. But it's almost like the same scent. So don't let them fool you, okay? Don't let them fool you. Same scent. If you got anything cinnamon, that's all you're going to smell is cinnamon. And I think that's what a lot of the pumpkin is, isn't it? Cinnamon. Pumpkin spice or something. Maybe I'm wrong. This one is, oh, the Champagne Shimmer. This is a ring collection. So this is size 6 ring. Size 10 ring. Size nine ring. So you, yeah, when you choose it that way, the surprise candles, I don't nece necessarily go, I, I don't, I don't buy this for the jewelry. You've heard me say that if you watch these videos before, I don't buy it for the jewelry. I buy it because I love the candles and I love the throw of the candles. So I couldn't care less about the jewelry. Um, I wish they didn't have the jewelry in it, to be honest. Anyways, if you like rings or whatever, this is size six and this is champagne. Oh, that one smells nice. Ooh, Champagne Shimmer. I've never had this one before. This is new. Never had that one. None of these candles I bought before. I haven't bought any of these candles before. Um, I've had one similar to this, but I don't think I've ever bought it before. So I'm happy they're all four can. Diff what the Jesus did I do? Four different candles that I've never bought before. I was going to say something. Ah, Charmed Aroma. If you watch this video, which I don't think you will, but if somehow you do, you have an advent calendar. So Charmed Aroma has an advent calendar that's like $100, I think it's US, but it's all their jewelry. And to be honest, guys, I think their jewelry is kind of crap. Honestly, I do. Their necklaces are so thin that they break like that. They're very frail. Their necklaces are very frail. I've never had any of the earrings yet. Their rings, I'm, I don't have the rings up, but their rings, they turn after a while. You know what I mean? And I'm like, really? You guys came out with an advent calendar and it's your silly jewelry? Come on. You're famous because of your candles. I think they need to realize that, hey, the, the jewelry is a great little surprise, but people buy it because they love candles. Honestly, okay? 85% of the population guaranteed there's going to be somebody in my comments going, no, I only buy the jewelry. I buy it because I love the jewelry. All right. You're telling me you don't love the candles? We're all candle fiends here. This is the candle community on YouTube for the candles. I'm like, you made an advent calendar for the jewelry? There's no candle? What? Why? No, no, not into that. Let me tell you something. If Charmed Aroma came out with an advent calendar next year, even with mini candles no jewelry that stuff will sell out like crazy you got 12 months of the year you know what i mean you can do 12 months you can do 24 months you know what i mean 24 days of christmas right they have so many amazing candles they can do in little mini candles just a little mini glass candles it doesn't have to be like an owl candle or something like that i would go nuts over that 
So yeah, Charmed Aroma. I mean, if you did full size, girl, mm -hmm. without the jewelry, make it cheaper, you know, like, come on. I wish you would make candles that didn't have jewelry and it would be cheaper. You know what I'm saying? Because most people buy it because they love the scent and the throw. This is Jelly Donut. It is a soy wax blend. It's a ring, size six. Never had this one before. This one's kind of crappy. I'm going to tell you honestly now, the throw on this is going to get you, I can't even smell it. Like, there's like a little hint, a little tiny whisper of a smell on this one. Yeah. Jelly donut. This is, there's like, there's nothing. I'm literally putting my nostrils together to try to get the smell of this. There's a little hint on this one, guys. Don't go, don't buy this one, jelly donut. If you buy these for the throw, stay away from the candles that look like this. Okay. The ones that look like this, there's a, a few of them. The throw is crap. Just saying. All right, last but not least. Oh, God, I hope it's a good one. It's blue. Let it be good. Let it be good. Fresh rain. I love it. Love this one. I don't want it to smell. They kind of look kind of. Okay. Uh, just make sure you smell your candles or ask me and I'll let you know and say, yeah, this one, no good. This one, very good. One of my favorites. I've bought it before. Like my last shipment, I had this candle in it. I really, really like this one. It smells like, well, it's called Fresh Rain, but for me, it smells like almost a little bit masculine, but nice, you know, a nice, clean man. That's what it smells like to me. Right. So I'm happy. I mean, there's only one candle that I'm like, eh, it's a dud. Really? Only one. Um. Yeah, this one here, not happy with at all. One thing is, you know, it'd be nice if you buy, like, the surprise candles. I wouldn't expect it if you just bought one, right? But I bought six. So it would be nice if they actually put, like, a surprise for you to go, Ooh, I wasn't expecting that. Like the owl or the Harry Potter. I know they're not going to do that, but every now and then, it would be nice to do that, Charmed Aroma. If somebody's buying six surprise candles or nine or twelve you know, and you throw in one of those, that would be a brilliant surprise. Uh, but yeah, this one, this one, Jelly Donut, don't buy everybody. I can't smell it. It's it's not going to have a good throw on it. So I this is a no for me. They're all ring candles, um, which I was hoping they would throw in like maybe an earring candle. I don't wear these rings, right? I like to keep the necklaces, but they are very frail. Um, so, you know, they're not that greatly made. They will fall apart. They will break if you pull on it one time. <laughs> I've already broken one. Um, so they are very frail. But it would have been nice to have either a necklace or an earring in here. You know, instead of all six to be rings. Um, but anyways, which one is my favorite? Oh my God. That is a hard choice. I know it's not that one. So I'll just put that one away. I do love this one, um, but I'm thinking these two are, you know, I love the smell of this, and I'm thinking this was a nice surprise. I'm thinking I'm really going to like this one, the Champagne Shimmer. Maybe I should bring this one on my honeymoon. It makes sense, right? Champagne Shimmer. Wouldn't that make sense? You know, Champagne Honeymoon. I don't know. Hard decision because this one will bring a nice smell to the room. This one will bring a beauty smell to the room. And the fresh rain will bring a, bring a beauty smell to the room. So maybe I'll let my husband decide on which one um, I'm going to bring. And I'm going to give one to my nephew. And he's going to decide over these two and the jelly donut. Because I know he likes the cinnamon one. So um, he'll want one of those. Anyways, that's my video. Have you guys ever tried these flavors scents before which one is your favorite um yeah let me know i can't i love it when they do the surprise candles i do and i can't wait for when they do it again and um, i'm gonna be writing a letter and giving me my my opinions and my thoughts on things the advent calendar candle advent calendar only candles and uh you know Maybe actually surprise somebody with a more expensive candle. Because, you know, these candles will go on sale for like $17.99. You know what I mean? So that's it, everybody. 
Thanks for watching my video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!